Fun at Storybook Land, where we have nothing scary, just happy Halloween fun. Climb aboard our happy hayride, pick and decorate a pumpkin at the pumpkin patch, and find your way through Elmer's Haymazing Maze. Add this to Storybook Land's 18 family rides, laid back atmosphere, great food, and classic storybook attractions. And you have a spooktacular fall day. Tickets and hours are available online at storybookland.com. Good morning, guys. Thank you so much for checking us out on the NordCast Weather Channel. We've got a cold front that is kind of closing in from the west. And as it does so, we have the increase of cloud cover. We also have a chance of a couple spotty showers through mid and late morning. And then the sunshine comes back out behind that front this afternoon. You're going to notice the temperatures come down. Yesterday, we had record setting highs across the area. Today's still toasty. Don't get me wrong. Mid and upper 70s, but not as hot. This is going to set us up for a nice weekend overall with partly to mostly sunny skies, cooler temperatures, and lower humidity as well. 66, a popular number right along the Northeast Corridor from uh, Boston to New York, Philadelphia, and D.C. The cooler weather awaits us out to the west. You can clearly see where that cold front resides. Temperatures over the weekend will be right around normal, so we're going to take that. It's going to feel great. And then we start to spike back up as we go into early to mid next week. Another couple days with those temperatures back in the upper 70s. So here are the clouds this morning, maybe a spotty shower, winds pick up a little this afternoon, and the sunshine is back with us for the weekend overall. Warm front comes through on Monday, another chance, small chance of a passing shower that's really gonna bring the temperatures back up. For today, about 77 decreasing clouds through the day. Tonight we'll drop down into the 40s. By daybreak, probably about 47 or so. Then tomorrow, 64, we wind it back quite a bit and we shift those winds out of the north northeast at five to ten miles an hour seven day forecast has us with that nice weekend but look at where we go tuesday and wednesday before our next chance of rain comes in on thursday i'm hoping to introduce these chances more frequently because we desperately need the rain have yourselves a great day everybody